it completely exceeded my expectations. I thought it was amazing. It was fantastic the way that you could interact so much with what was going on. Um, I loved the fact that there was all the cinematography there, that um, you almost were brought along on the journey of Titanic in regards to the big cinema screen and the timing and the SOS messages. I thought that was fantastic, not only for people that would be big Titanic fans, but it's also a way to incorporate it for children and the giant iPads, all that interactive, I thought it was extremely clever. Um, I couldn't believe that um, after hearing the story, we were able to travel around and after seeing the first class cabins and all the different areas, when Titanic was obviously hit the iceberg, um, the Titanic experience here in Sherbrooke, you're able to go back around and see what all these cabins are like underwater. So exceeded my expectations, um, amazing, so good. Yes, I suppose, um, you know, uh, Cove, which back then was also known as Queenstown, um, it was the last port of call for Titanic. Um, we had over 300 passengers that got on the ship in Cove and 197 of them perished on the ship. So, I mean, the same as Cherbourg and Southampton and other cities, we all share a small bit of history in the tragic story of Titanic. So that is something, to join the cities of Titanic, that is something that links all of us. Even though, yes, Titanic is a tragedy and we did commemorate this in April. Also, it's something that brings immigration, emigration, it joins all the cities together. So it's wonderful for Cove to be part of the Titanic cities.